Hey Mech Warriors, welcome back to Opa Plays Mech Warrior 5. We're at the end of the DLCs, we're hunting clan pieces, parts, and mechs. And we've already finished off all the bounty hunter, including the bounty hunter himself. And just to highlight that, I will scroll down and show you. Oh no, I think, yep, I did. I put it in cold storage. Or did I? I might have sold it. Yep, Mad BH. So, still got it. Didn't consider it to be uh, all that good a mech, tell you the truth. I, mean, I, I think a good mech is one that can put out as much alpha damage as its tonnage. So, 55 for the alpha damage on this guy for a 75 ton mech? Yeah, not impressed. Not impressed with this one either, so we're going to sell it. That was salvaged from the last mission. And just to give you a highlight, what, what I mean with that, alpha damage 106. 70 tons. Alpha damage, 73. 80. Okay, it's close. 90. Alpha, 65. 78. Alpha, 50. Just random selections. Almost 100. Uh, double LBXs doesn't show well. Hmm. Okay, that one's not at all. Oh, he's still... Yeah. Is he still in repair? That was an 11-day fix-up. Oh, no, it was a 32, second mission. Yeah. Nova Prime, 93 for a 50. Yeah. Highlander Clan Mech. 89 for a 90. Close enough. This, 55 for 75. Sleeper, not doing his job. <clears throat> well, while we were here last time, he does, at the end of the mission we episode, we did a quick uh, scan around and uh, found out that only this one had clan missions, and it had three. So I'm going to go up here and pick what I want to do when I get there. And I say that because it's still within the zone of Harlock's, Harlock's Warriors. And I might be able to entice him to join the fray and give me up some money. And even though we finished off the uh, Bounty Hunter overall mission, the Bounty Hunter still pays in intel points, and when you get enough of them, you get a good, pretty good payoff. So, still doing that. And how do you tell? Well, you do this one, but I'm not going for the clan ever. So this one is against the clan. And the way you tell if it's got a, a mercenary drop is an inordinate amount of cash up front. So not this one. This one? An inordinate amount of cash. For a 230-ton mission... This is an inordinate amount of cash up front. Still get to pick solid shares and all that stuff. So the Harlock Warriors are about to get creamed and screamed at. Because here I come. 230 is a pretty light one. I think I just made it right there. And I want to upsize the Crusader? Of course I do. I got 15 tons to go. Sorry, Kelpie, you're out of here. Everybody else is still in repair anyway. I think we're going to give what I would normally take would be the uh, the onion. And call that, a, a, yep, call that good. Yeah, I just got to check real quick because I'm not sure what kind of mission we're on. And that doesn't tell me either. Rut row. How many other people say rut row? Scooby Doo. We're going in. I can always switch to the onion if I need to. By onion, I'm, it's a play on words, Orion Protector. 
The protector or the partisan? Protector. Partisan. Starts with a P. I get crossed up between that and the uh, Black Knight, which is also a P. Nice shrooms. Okay, bed. Yep. Nice shrooms. Where are they at? Silence. <laughs> Yes, we will. Lock on and terminate. Where's the other guy? Thought there was two. There he is. Hiding shrooms. So a little tidbit of the inordinate amount of money has proven to be absolutely accurate three times in a row. No, they won't. They're programmed that way. Nineteen of them, huh? I did not set up a good set of mechs on this one. I don't have a single long range LRM missile firing anything. So a lot of running around. Fortunately, the archer egg and quartz pretty fast. Target acquired. Once you've found the targeted asset, move on to it. I get that later. Ah. So this guy's got Okay. Thought they killed him, but they didn't apparently. Now the way I play a defense is uh, really crucial that the AI Lance does what I tell it to do. When I tell it to do it. I'm not getting that right now because Pretty Baby should have killed that tank back there by now. I don't get why that tank's still living. Pretty baby just standing there. Not doing what they're told, that's all there is to it. Yes, they are. Yep, pretty baby's not doing what I'm telling it. I told him to shoot that VTOL. No 
your position. Get ready for some company. <laughs> I think I've got a second now. Cargo acquired. Target acquired. I don't know why I'm playing like this like the 80% uh, matters. It really doesn't. I've already got 10 of them. I don't need the achievement. Can't believe I didn't kill it. I lost track of where Pretty Baby is, even. Hey, Nuke, shoot that. Yes, my commander. Exactly. And this guy's coming in fast, so I'll target him. It'll let me. Here we go. That's a fast one. Yeah, mushroom got in the way. Bad shot. Hey, little adder. Yep, five more. I need this guy because he's closest. Didn't put enough on him to get his attention, probably. Gave up the cure about ten percent ago. Whoopsie, missed. Target 
Should be it. That's the problem with some of the defense missions against a very small place. They get through and it, it, it's over. You can't get your 80% bonus. But in this case, it's a... Uh, yeah, 40% bonus. Because I don't have the... Uh, to worry about the achievement thing of... 10 times getting uh, defense done with 80% or better still left. That's a long time ago. Well, that's a long way off. And a couple of ravines ago. Well, obviously it's two tanks. Feel free to skip towards the end, but I prefer the uh, that you don't because I get the watch time as part of the analytics of the channel. It's how many hours are actually watched and how much percentage of the uh, video is actually watched, etc. Big mushrooms. That's what they're stuck in, isn't it? That's a fungus. That's why sometimes if you want something done, you got to go do it yourself. Should have done the back on that. Three million. Yeah, it was promising a whole lot more, wasn't it? Okay. 300 points. Always good. Hit the continue, Opa. There we go. 21 points worth of stuff. Got adders. Got griffins. Sold them. If that was really worth 14 million, I'd snatch it up in a heartbeat. I don't know if you can see it because of the graphics involved, but because I'm playing at 4K. But see the double heat sink kit with the lines, it's got lines through it, diagonal. So is the Clan XL engine and the armor pharaoh. That means you can't strip them from the mech. <clears throat> so all that really great stuff you can't have you can sell this mech for about four million but you can't have that now four million is still a good grab and a good payoff for 16 share cost but be advised you're not getting that this mech doesn't have those things so it is what you see all three of them Nope. Nothing from the bottom of the pile. I think I'm going to have enough ERM lasers for a while. Yeah, not nothing there. No heat sinks, no nothing. Not a big fan of salvage for non clan mechs. I'll start adding up some adder. I'm really not sure if I've got it selected to uh, come back populated or not when I pull it out of salvage. Makes a big difference. Okay, I got one left. I'll take it. 
That's some serious damage here, isn't it? Look at the differential. Three times the damage you're doing. Okay, I didn't get three times the kills, but I got... <clears throat> I guess I put stuff on the target. And damage-wise, this was a nothing burger. Everybody's in really good shape. So we're going to go ahead and punch that uh, repair all, even though we're out in the wild. Did I just repair something I don't want to repair? No, we're just already ongoing. Okay. We're probably pouring up, run out of a welcome here in this area. Yep, no more clam. That was me going off screen for a second. Had to uh, check to see where I was. I think we're going to slide over this way. We're still all in light mission areas. Not the 400 tonners that would really give me a clan assault mech. So maybe I need to get somewhere more centralized. I'm not sure. We're kind of out on the edge here, so to speak. What's this guy for ratings? 8 to 10, and we're in a zone that is 7 to 10. So I need higher than 10 if I'm going to pull an assault max. That's obvious. Let's scoot all the way over here to Marduk, so we're over this way, because I think this way is, a, yeah, 12, 13. We'll go to Marduk and take a look around real quick. Excuse me for a second. I'm going to cough. <clears throat> Oi. One of the meds I take, in case you're wondering, gives me lots of phlegm production. It is a constant issue I have to deal with. I am an oba, I take meds. A medium mace. Well, I have to say... That has never been on my list of things I want. Neither is this episode, that mission. That, Operation Onada, is one of the most unbalanced missions in the entire set of all the missions out there. You start off at a 270 for the very first mission, and it is just a crusher. I mean, I can beat it. I don't, want, I don't like it. I don't see the point. ERLP clan. Hmm. One never knows. I'm always in the search of good long or large lasers. And good ballistics, but I've got better than that now, so I don't... I mean, it used to be a scramble just to find a tier zero so LBX-10 solid. Now it's a no thank you. I am still looking for good SRMs. You might have noticed I like SRMs. They play well with my style of play. Ah. Uh, I'll take one of them. I don't like the predictive. I find it to be incorrect, actually. I'll take two of them. Don't need more of those. Hmm. When does the mobility gyro come out into play? I just haven't seen it. I don't shop much, but haven't seen it. What we got all the way over here? Objective Raid, Federated Sun, 400 ton, 
against the clan. Slam dunk, easy choice. Look, since we're going that way anyway, I'm going to stop in here at Mendham and see what they got for that special. Best way to fix that whole thing of we don't shop much is to shop more. Ah, I couldn't write this stuff better if I had to. A medium hatchet. Never been on my wish list. What else we got? Flexibility. Uh, we're not into yoga. We're into running faster. I'm not going to sell. What am I doing? All oh, whips. Just pick two of those up. How about some more? Still, oh, LBX 10 clan. Ouch. That's got to be a decent one. I'm going to take a look at it. <clears throat> of course, I could have taken a look at it without buying it, couldn't I? I did say just ballistics, right? Okay, I did. Scooch it down, LBX... Okay, 10 tons, 15 points, give or take. And I think you can switch that back and forth. So I'm not going to call that anything. Huh. Uh huh. Okay. Damage per second, 7.3. I don't have a direct compare. Eight. It's really kind of hard to no no no. That's almost a full point better. Yeah, that's almost a full point better. Okay, it's a ton less. That's about it. Rate of fire is twenty nine points. No, twenty nine and a half. Thirty. Yeah. Major improvements to ton less. Okay. I could have saved some money on that by looking first. It's a decent weapon. It's not what I need. Triple A, what do you got? Phoenix Hawk. I have never seen this one before. I did not know it existed. That's an okay stock mech because it does 42 damage for 44, 45 tons. And you can always upgrade and get that much, much better. The next cell engine. That is a 19 million C-bills. Nope. Nothing there. Nothing there. Hmm. Nothing there. Well, what we do know is over here is an objective raid that I think I want to do. Not there. Nope. That's it. So we're going to wind up over here in the next episode of Oprah Plays Mac Warrior 5. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Come back and watch that next ep episode. Because until then, Opa is out. <laughs>